too. What's up, it's your girlfriend, Nadja Chick, and I'm back. I just wanted to do a quick video because I haven't um, done a wash and go in quite some time. So I just recently um, did one. It's getting warm, super warm outside. So um, I haven't done one in a while because, you know, it was kind of, it was cool out and, you know, wet here and cold weather. Not a good mix, but now it's like super, super hard outside. Like it's summer weather right now, uh, where I'm at in the spring. So um, now is the time I can start doing them a little more, not all the time, um, because it is a lot of um, manipulating on my hair. So I try. I'm trying to assume so much um, on like a kind of a growth challenge right now doing more protective styles so um definitely i won't be doing them as much but you know they are uh they can be convenient at times it does kind of like take me a while to do if i want it like just right like if i'm just gonna i do a lot of wash and goes and just put them in a puff you know those take you know like few minutes minutes with them like you know 15 minutes or so but if i really wanted to like wear my wash and go down is, is kind of time consuming. Um, so, you know, with, I have ridiculously thick hair, <laughs> but um, I kind of like liking my results. Um, I do get a lot of shrinkage. So what I wanted to do was I want to try out a product uh, that I've seen in the hair store. And here it is. It's Aunt it's on Jackie's um, Don't Shrink uh, Flaxseed Elongating uh, Curling Gel. Um, I mean, I don't, I don't know if it did help with um, elongating a whole lot, but. Um, I do feel like I don't have as much um, shrinkage as I usually do when I do a wash and go. Now I'm not 100% dry, but you know, it's it's dry enough where, you know, it's it's not like super wet. Like the insides is already, is always what takes like forever too. Um, but I do like my definition. Let me go ahead and give you a twirl. Okay, so um, yeah, I do like the definition and I feel like it is a little more um, elongated than usual, but I mean, the truth of the matter is, depending on your hair type, if you, your hair type, you got a tighter curl, which I have a really tight curl pattern. There's not a lot of products out there that probably will, you know, really elongate your curl the way you want. Like, my elongation, when I'm thinking about I want my curls to be elongated, I'm thinking, like, when it's in its wet state. You know, because when I first did it, you know, I, did, I always do it, like, on my hair when it's, like, dripping wet. Because my hair is so thick that it dries up so fast. And I also noticed that I had to use quite a bit of this gel. It's my first time using it and I have to use quite a bit because um, if it starts drying up while while I'm um, applying the product or some if I miss any strand of my hair it's just I have to make sure my hair is soaking wet and that the product is on like every strand of my hair for me to have a successful wash and go and so which means I end up using a lot of product depending on the product it's like kind of a this product is is it's it's kind of um I, I like like kind of thicker products it's kind of it's not as thick so when it comes to my hair and it being so thick, I kind of need a, something that's thick, a thicker type of gel as well. So I did also apply my Old Faithful, which is my wet line. So I used this and um, the 
these two kind of together. You know, I use this first, mostly this, and then I kind of put, you know, my wet line over it just to kind of, you know, have it, you know, cause that, the wet line's a lot more thicker to me than um, the five seam. But I mean, all in all, like, I can't really say. I think I would probably try it again. Um, I wouldn't give it up like just yet and I wouldn't say oh it's it's the best thing ever I don't know yet but just my first experience with it I do notice that my hair does look a little more elongated than usual when I usually do my regular uh, wash and go so it's it's worth giving a shot and I really think probably somebody that has like a looser curl pattern that it would probably really you know or not hair is not as thick as mine um, cause it's, it's hard for my hair to lay down or stay flat cause it, it just is so thick. So it just wants to, you know, kind of poof out. So it's kind of hard to find anything probably for me that's going to have my hair just long, like elongated. And I think it definitely does to me depending on your curl pattern. So I just want to share that with you. But I did also, when I did um, get the product I also found um, seal it up from on Jackie's and this this will be a keeper definitely a keeper it smells good um, if you can see it's kind of you know it's a butter kind of texture it's a light it's like a whipped kind of whipped um, kind of feel and I, I really like it it's called seal it seal it up it's a hydrating um, sealing butter, so you can use this, um, you know, if you're doing a lock method. And I use this um, after after I uh, wash my hair, and I this I think will be a staple for me. I will repurchase this. Um, I didn't have to use a whole lot, and just a little bit that I used, it just really softened it up and really made it feel like moisturized. So definitely. I will be repurchasing that product. This one, I'll have to give it another go, um, another time. You know, I don't want to just say yet if I really, really, really love it. I wouldn't say I love it. I don't not like it, but um, definitely this is a keeper for me. Maybe I will use whatever I have left and um, We'll see what happens, but as of now, I probably definitely my wet line is is gonna be what I'll use um, in the meantime. But that, that's it. I just wanted to let you see my latest hair style here. A little wash and go. Um, what I want to do is I think I'm gonna try to the whole pineapple thing. <laughs> That does not work for me. That if I put my hair but upon pineapple at night, it's gonna stay like that and it's not gonna come back down. So that's not for me at all. But what I will probably do is I usually I got my little um, hair ties here, so I'll probably just put them into like kind of I just kind of part them in two buns and um, put my scarf on and then in the morning I'll just kind of you know fluff it out and kind of mess with it and play with it and see what happens and um, if all else fails it will go in a puff like it usually always does but um, that's it guys I just wanted to show you let me get a little close up of the curls the little curl pattern going on here um, I just want to show you my wash and go and um, that's it guys for today I will see you in the next video and thank you for watching